after we did. You want some more sushi? Um, other than that, I had fun, right? Did you have fun? Yeah. yeah. So, Laura and Adam, she said the advice that she gave all of you guys is to just have a good time tonight. How much of it was a good time and how much was there still that competitive nature to really make sure you came out on top tonight? Yeah, I don't think I have done all of it. I was just taking it out like, the last time we get to, yeah. well, no, tomorrow's the last time we get to be on stage, but the last time we get to in competition, in competition perform for America, and like, um, just so uh, honored, blessed to be here, and just, um, I don't know, I, I, I'm just really happy that we all got through, and this week was really, literally hell week. It was so hard, <laughs> but uh, I'm so proud of everyone, and um, the top 20 again, performing with them, they were brilliant, uh, but like, I just, words can't describe how they <laughs> I can't describe. How I'm so, I always say it like at this point, there's so many things that goes on in our hands, and so many things that we try to pick up the geography and things that we want to learn, and things that we want to do. There's just a lot of information that has like competitions and last. Each other is what we have when we go home. Like the last people that we see, the last people that we see are our dancers, you know, and it'll be a shame to you. Look at each other as competitors because we're not friends. Yeah. We will be together to support our strength, our drive, and from each other. Oh, yeah. Like it may look like we're all like at each other, but really we're all trying to push everyone to, to be better. Like we're always pushing each other, and it's um, and it's a great feeling. I love it. And, like, just dancing with everyone on stage, like his energy on stage, it makes me better. It makes me better. And, no, I'm serious. I don't. I don't mean that for the camera and all that. So, like, it's everyone has their own quality, and like we feed off each other, and we all push each other to be greater. How are you guys holding up physically? You did four dances, a solo, and I think you just did your group dance that we're going to see tomorrow. That's a lot of dancing in one day. Anything hurting? Everything. Everything. <laughs> <laughs> like I, I, I feel muscles that muscles that I didn't know I had. Yeah. They're just sore. My shoulders are like just killing me from all the lifts from disco. Oh my gosh. <laughs> That was so yeah. That was 80% lifting, 20% dancing. That's like a lifting routine. But, I mean, yeah. but we're done. I mean, we're done. And we're right now, all the pains are. I'm happy. Do you have. You guys, step on, you guys step this way a little bit. Do you have any reactions towards the um, comment from Nigel about the girls are going to win? Do you, as a guy, have a comment or a girl? Do you have any comments towards that? I mean, he said that in the beginning of the season, um, and he said it again tonight. Like I always say, it doesn't matter. <laughs> um, we've already, in our opinion, we've already all won. You yeah. know, the the experience that we gained, the knowledge that we gained, just the friendship that we have, that's enough. You know, that's the prize that we've all been wanting. And money can be taken away, contracts to to endorsements, jobs can be taken away. You know, it'll all be done after a while. The experience will never be. There's all the training, all the training that we made, all the friendships that we made, the connections it will never go away. So I am more happy about that than winning any money. Money is paper. Out of all, sorry, out of all the dances tonight, which one do you think best represents your true ability? What? Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Out of all the dances that you did tonight, uh -huh. which one do you feel best represents your true ability? Um, cha cha. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. 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 Horrible. <laughs> um, definitely, you know, jazz, contemporary. Um, I had so. I always have fun in rehearsals with Sonia, and she has. She definitely has whipped us all into like. Like top notch, we can go like train in the Olympics right now. I think, <laughs> but um, but yeah, we have so much respect for her and every choreographer on here. Um, they all they all bring or brought in, like a different energy, and we all I think observed it. Um, I can't say words. I can't speak. I can't speak right now. But um, basically, we all got better. <laughs> yeah, Sonia's no joke. Seriously, yeah. I haven't had the opportunity and the privilege to work with her. Um, three or four times this season. My first, my very first routine was with her, and having her 
was like trying to learn how to run before you could even walk. So everything that I did after I had her in the first week was like, eh, because I already had someone there. <laughs> you know, um, but as far as my routine that best represent me tonight, I would say my piece with Lauren, choreographed by uh, Tassandra Chavez. Tassandra Chavez is one of my favorite choreographers out, out here in, in LA, and I was so happy and so excited when I found that I get to have her, and it felt really good. Really good. Marco, uh, speaking of that routine, it's like, how do you feel being the guy who can make everybody cry, <laughs> including Lofro? Yeah, and your dad was here all the way from Guam, you were in tears, what was that like too? Um, it was so insane because I, whenever I dance things like that, I always really dig, dig deep uh, within me, and I try to find something that would relate to my to my to my pieces. And it just it's so overwhelming, but it's so just I don't know how to explain it. I don't know where it comes from. It's just somewhere deep within, and it just. It's great. I mean, I'm a crier, so. <laughs> your mom, we saw it from your mom too. She's crying. Yeah, well, she always, she's always crying. Yeah. <laughs> she does. Happy or sad, she's always crying. I can, I can now, I don't even know how her eyes look like. She's always crying. Like, <laughs> <laughs> and what are your plans after the show's finished? You're gonna be do the tour, but do you want to join companies or do you want to be in movies or what are your plans? All of the above. I want to yeah. do everything. Keep everything, it coming. Keep it coming. Everything. Yeah. Everything. Yeah. Everything. Yeah. I mean, um. I was already, I was dancing professionally out here in LA before the show and I'm gonna go out, just do just that, but with a lot more on my back, you know, with a lot yeah. more knowledge, a lot more experience and with a better head, you know, it just, yeah. all this has changed us in the, for the better and it's, we're, I can't wait for what's in store for us and the world just watch out for us. Yeah, we definitely all got whipped into snatch shape. It's on the show. We know how to handle every single style now, and we know what to expect. So I, I think that we all have a bright future. The whole, all of top 20.